Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to another episode of Let's Play Final Fantasy VII. Our last episode was the biggest episode yet, where Meteor was summoned by none other than Sephiroth. Cloud is nowhere to be found. Of course, we're hanging out with good old Tifa and Baretto. Although, I don't know if we have a better weapon for him yet. Nope, we're just chilling with the enemy launcher. At least it's long range. Uh, let's see. Can we just give him something better? Diamond bangle? Sure. Alright. Um. I don't know if we actually have a fight to do. Which makes things a little bit more difficult. And I. Yeah, we have no access to cloud. Uh oh. Well, all of his freaking materia is gone. For now. For now. Imagine they also killed off cloud. You're like, oh my god. Alright, well, uh, in this case. We'll just hope that this is enough for our boy Barrett. Don't worry, guys. Everything you see here is canon. Look at this friggin' giant statue in the middle. Amazing. Wish you could read it. Can't pass. Why not? I like how when you talk to someone, his arms break out. Is everyone here? These are the ones who brought this madness into our world. The hell are these people? We will be broadcasting your miserable deaths live on national television. Scarlet, why a public execution in this day and age? With the chaos resulting from the media reports, we desperately need to rally public support. It's better that we punish somebody, anybody. You make me sick. <laughs> They'll never admit it, but everyone loves this stuff. We'll start with this girl. If you gotta do it, take me first! Camera, this way. Make sure you get this. The audience just eats up tearful goodbyes. What are you doing? This is my special gas chamber. Take your time and enjoy a slow, painful death. Bitch. I think she did that because uh, Tifa spit on her, but there's no sound effect. <laughs> well, now the show is about to begin, especially with a car going by. <laughs> emergency! Emergency! Weapons approaching! Attention, all military personnel! Take your positions! Oh no! It's a weapon! Run! Hey, hey, all of you! Damn, why now? How does it feel now, Scarlet? Mm, so you didn't run, I'm impressed. How do I feel right now? Uh, huh, what the hell? Hey now! Oh crap, my two like most undergeared characters. All right, let's go boys. Look at that freaking rocket launcher. Can they even kill these two? Well, at least they're basically doing no damage to us. God damn, I wonder how much health they have. This might take six years, uh, depending. Oh, of course. At least Ketchy can do 300 damage. But something tells me they have like 30,000 health. I knew I should have bought Barret his new weapon. Ugh. Okay, that's fine.
Oh no, Barret! Oh my god, you guys are all blind. Quite literally. All blind. Alright, we got a hit, got a hit. I could cure the blindness. These guys do so little damage, I don't think it matters as much. Might as well build up some of our lemon break. Yeah, get him, Kitchy. I still like, I, I'm pretty sure he just beats the enemies to death with a microphone. I don't think he even yells into the microphone. Unless he's doing like a lemon break. Giant stuffed Moogle just attacks all the monsters. I beat the hell out of the enemies as they beat the hell out of me. I enjoy the pain. Alright, finally, after six years, we have defeated the enemy. Okay. I'm here to help. Why, you? Mean you part of Shinra? Let's just say I'm against capital punishment. Besides, I hate this broad. Come on, we gotta help Tifa. I'll keep watch at the entrance. Alright, if you say so. Fools, I've already pushed the switch. Uh oh. Shit! It won't open. Which weapon? There's been so many attacks lately. Can we handle it? I believe so. Your orders? No need to ask. Give it a shot from our big cannon. Open cannon doors. Activate cannon. Target weapon. Operations complete, sir. The cannon. Fire! Did we get him? Team so. Weapon approaching. Speed, 50 knots. It's heading right towards us! It can't be! We hit it dead on! How about the cannon? It'll take time to reload! Then use regular firepower in the meantime. Yes, sir! Open all artillery doors! Target weapon! Don't let it land! Seventy knots. Weapon closing in. Not good. It's attacking.
Hold your breath. Hold on as long as you can. Come on, I can't hold on forever. Shit. Cast room's probably locked from a different room. Hmm. We gotta go with a different plan. Let's get out of this room first. Viva! I'll help you. I promise. All right, hold on. <laughs> also, we equip Ketchy real quick. Oh my God, he has nothing. He has a, du a shitty double growth too. Oh my God. We can give him a quad growth. Do that one. Alright, uh, nothing like less damage for Ketchy. God damn. This is what I get for neglecting my characters. Alright, what do we got? We got a wizard bracelet with crazy magic defense. Uh, you know what? God damn it, all my magic is just gone. Uh, gig ass armlet. Let's just do, let's do bolt armlet so we can avoid bolt, I guess. Protects against frog and small. I, I don't know, man. Can we at least have, okay, wait. Oh, never mind. We do have all our abilities from uh, Cloud. Okay, great. Okay, counterattack, cover. Uh, he already has long range, HP plus. Uh, what else are we doing? I think we're doing probably like a added effects, maybe. Nah, probably not. Let's just do time. All. And what else? I know. <clears throat> the most intense battle of all time. During a kaiju battle, and I'm just like messing with all my shit. That's what I get for not prepping any of these characters out. At this point, we should just buy a bunch of materia and like set ourselves up perfectly. So, at least we have a bunch of low rank gear for later, but it's alright. I'm not too worried about it. Uh, all barrier seems good. And then. I don't know. Uh. In case we get into a bind, let's grab Bahamut. <laughs> He's so pricey, though. Uh, you know what? Actually, let's do Ifrit. Ifrit has no love. All right. We got Ifrit. Arrange it. Right. I wanted to remove him to put him on the side here. Okay. Uh, and an elemental, maybe? Or HP absorb? I guess we do HP absorb uh, with a death blow. Or we could do MP Turbo. Nah, probably HP Absorb. And then Death Blow. I think that works? I don't know. I don't know. Uh, and then Kate Sith. Do Fire. All. MP Turbo. I don't know. Oh, we don't have other fire attacks. That's right. Shit, man. We suck. Alright, you get Chocomog. Can we MP Turbo? Uh, no, only paired with magic. Okay. Damn, dude. We need more fire attacks. Sucks. Oh, that's because Sid has all our good shit. Oh, no. All right. You know what? Roll down here. Oh, man. He doesn't even have anywhere near as good a stuff right now. Well, all right. Let's just give him all... Comet. Like a beast. And then... MP Absorb Lightning, maybe? I don't know. Probably not really worth it at this point. We'll give him Revive. MP Plus. And then... M Magic Plus. Alright, so he has Fire, Comet, and Revive. And Chocomog. Alright, cool. Seems great. Also, do we even have Restore on either of these characters? No, we don't. Oh my god. Sorry, I'm the worst. Uh, instead of Revive, because everyone knows we never die in this game. <laughs> Definitely didn't die randomly in a previous fight. Nope. Never happened. Crazy. Let's get going. No! They locked us out! Now you can save the girl. 
<laughs> God damn it! Okay, okay, time for plan B. Let's run to the airport. Why the airport and leave Tifa here? Trust me, trust me. We got to take a chance. Where the hell's the airport? I actually forget. Well, all good, the game guides my hand. Perfect. Where are you going? The airport's the other way, you dummy. Don't you know that? Don't you live here in the Shinra headquarters, you bastard? Oh god, we're fighting soldier now. Alright, hit him with Comet. Second class? Oh, baby, alright. Basically using, like, a version of one of Cloud's ultimate weapons, right? I don't know. It looks kind of like it. Maybe this is a regular sword. Actually, wait a minute. I bet we could steal from him. Oh, no. All right. Oh, you think you're such a big shot, but you dead. Hell yeah. All material leveled up, too. Nice. My favorite tracks in the game. Yo! Is that Yuffie? Hello, boys. Oh, shit. If you run into them, they attack you. Oops. Oh, God. And Soldier, of course. Alright, that's pretty good damage. That's not bad. Nice block. Good counter with a crit. Sword of Doom? That's not allowed. Nice counter again. Uh, let's Kira the Barret. Go for the D blow. Good shit. We got 65 health back from that. Not a lot, but you know, whatever. They just run away. Was it a random encounter then? I know you're in a hurry, but please, if you could have a word. Shut up, I'm in a hurry. Don't make so much noise to me, Yuffie. The hell you doing here? later. Now we gotta get to the airport. Oh my god, this is the coolest. I remember this scene being like my favorite part of the video game, man. I think it might still be one of my favorites. Freaking giant kaiju coming out of the water. I use the treasure chest to activate the elevator. Oh, crap, we have Ryuki on our team. God damn it. <laughs> Alright, at least it'll be easier to fight these soldier second classes. Yeah, we're doing just fine. Ow, I take it all back. We should have a limit break from that. Oh, bro. Okay, dice roll. Here we go. Alright, give me a game over. One out of one billion chance or whatever. Oh yeah, never mind. That's always slot machines. Haha, -ha. but he still took a ton of damage, which is great. Deep blow him. We're gonna blow his mind. Hey, we did it. Hell yeah. Most adorable Moogle of all time. I hate my life. All right, there we go. Best looking Moogles in all of Final Fantasy. Okay, I'm lying. The best looking Moogles is from Final Fantasy Tactics and 12. Yo! You sure this is the right way? It's a dead end! Uh, oh? Did I make a wrong turn? Damn cat! What the hell are we gonna do now? They all be coming soon! Yo! 
Better watch my back to the end, partner. I love Barrett, dude. He's so cool. Move your feet and arms and use your head to get out of the chair. Ah. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Legs. Oh, wow, you just straight up. You, don't, you just have to hold it down. You're good. Oh, oh, God, don't do it again. All right, don't fall unconscious, lady. All right, uh, head. And then legs again. Because it brought her legs back. Oh, you have to hold it. Okay, 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 okay. Okay. Oh my god! Try and combine two movements at once. Bro! Uh, okay, leg ahead? Oh, there we go, oh my god. Okay. I got you now. I didn't realize it literally meant, like, press two buttons at the same time. Uh, what? What do you mean? Oh. I made it! Jesus. Alright. Which button stops the gas? You open. Hey, open it! First, you locked me in this weird place, and now you're telling me to come out? Make up your mind! Goddamn. Although, <clears throat> seems like a kind of tiny laser beam from a big boy monster, but you know. Oh shit! Get the hell out of here. Run, Tifa! Good thing Tifa's leveled. I'm good to go. I love the- Oh shit, that guy's dead. Well, he had a good life. I think they were climbing down the goddamn cannon. Oh no! Tifa died. Oh! Hey look, we're in Crisis Core now. Uh, alright. Remember, Zach, follow your dreams. My dreams? What's Gact doing here? <gasps> we can't remaster this game, Gact, because Gact has his face in it. Sister Ray. Oh God, I'm sorry about that. I forgot I have a little arrow on my head. Our little game of hide-and-seek ends here. The execution may have been unsuccessful, but your death by falling and crashing into the water below might still be pretty exciting. <laughs> Stuck up to the end. Why, you... Payback! Stop it! Same to you! Ah, oh, fuck. God, I can't stand it! Take her away. Now it's time to pay up. Calm down, or I'll drop you. Run! Run to the end of the cannon!
okay. My cheeks hurt a bit. Forget it. Uh, what's all this about? Well, I'll catch the details later. In any case, the airship Highwind is now yours. The Highwind? I guess, yeah, Sid didn't make it, right? Oh, well, I'm glad you're safe. Poor Yuffie. Gets uh, airsick. I think she also, does she get seasick as well? I think you can take her along with you uh, for Junon, right? Where, uh, apparently the cockpit is to the right. <laughs> We're in floor B2. My hands are full, so I'll excuse myself here. Uh, we can fly the airship, we can chew the fat. Well, uh, what should I talk about? Want to hear why we rebelled? Yeah, sure. Working on the high wind, we spent every day slaving under Heidegger. Whenever he got uh, he got yelled at by the president, he'd immediately take it out on the crew. We put up with all this all the time, even when he beat us. I mean, I finally made it on the crew of the famous high wind, and there's no way I was uh, going to quit over him. Let's see, it must have been a week ago. It was my shift, and we were heading towards the northern cave. Everyone, including the president and Scarlet, got on. And with them, I saw Sid, a legendary pilot. And he was looking around the ship, of the sh uh, Sid's side of the ship, looking really, you know, nostalgic. He even talked to us. I couldn't believe it. I was so impressed. He was every bit as warm-hearted as we'd always heard. Sid said that he had the high wind. If he had the high wind, things would be a lot easier. And now here we are, off to sla save the planet. Slave the planet. It's true. He really overwhelmed me. And that's why we decided to help. After the northern cave, we went to Junon, and I started screaming, fire, fire. In the middle of all the commotion, we stole this ship from the ship. That's how it happened. Just a minor mutiny against our leaders. But Barrett and you were captured by Heidegger. We waited seven days for a chance to rescue you guys before we finally could. So thanks to our successful mission, we were able to see you guys again. I hope I didn't bore you too much with that long story. Chocobo? <laughs> I'm bored. I want to write a chocobo. No, 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 no. Okay, okay, so now we can store chocobos in here, which is awesome. I don't think we're allowed to save it in here, though. All right, Barrett. Damn it. Why didn't you tell me you could fly an airship? I thought, I thought Tifa was gone for good. Uh, sorry, but I had to do something to trick the enemy. Come on, everyone's waiting. Everyone, everyone's here? Welcome to my airship, the High Wind. Just walks right through him. <laughs> What's wrong? You should be more excited than that. Seed. Yeah, yeah. Not enough crew. What's that sad face for? Well, it takes all kinds. Tifa, I'll give you info on Shinra. Ask me if there's anything you don't understand. Do you think we are strong enough without Cloud? Do you think we can't save the planet alone? Meteor is coming, and Weapon is on the rampage. At a time like this, I don't know what I'm supposed to do. No idea at all. Get a hold of yourself, Tifa. Come on, let's think about this. No way we uh, get, can get off of this train we're on. If only Cloud was here, everything would be fine. Cloud would... St 
to him that cocky little way he did. Tell us what to do. He'd say, everything's under control, Tifa. Tifa, when you become such a wimp. I'm sorry, Barrett. I'm so depressed. I'm surprised at myself. And Tifa, the reason why we all thought it was Cloud was because... I know. That's why I want to make sure. That's why I have to see him again. So glad you're all right, Tifa. By the way, do you have a cell phone? <laughs> uh, pilot level three. Oh, uh, Captain said... Uh, Tifa, sorry, but uh, we gotta show this moron how to land the ship. Don't worry, it'll be done in a minute. Oh, and uh, Tifa, no matter what your goal is, you gotta be prepared. Go to the operation room and get ready. Will do, Captain Zid. Tifa, thank you for a job well done. Hey, give me Sid. Uh, give me... Oh man, that's a tough choice. Vincent or Red 13? Uh, I kind of want Vincent. Yeah, give me Vincent. Alright, now what? I'm in the operations room. What do you want from me, Sid? Oh, there we go. We can save it. Hell yeah. Alright, everyone. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you're enjoying the series so far. I know I am. And, uh, yeah. This game's an absolute blast, man. The story is freaking amazing. And, uh, I can't wait to do some more. I'm Acumene101, and I'll see you all next time. Take it easy.